Here in the history of medicine, it shows uh, Johannes Fibiger and his Nobel Prize for the uh, hy hypothe hypothesis that the worm causes stomach cancer. Um, in 1926, a Nobel Prize in medicine was awarded to this man for his for subsequently re his his after sub subsequently refuted discovery that gastric carcinoma in rats was caused by the nematode Spiroptera carcinoma. Um, now. The thing is, is he, he, he refu the claim was refuted that the worm causes cancer because the worm doesn't cause cancer. The, the worm cysts appear to be cancer and sacs, parts of it appear to be cancer. And um, there was a problem back then, just like now, of misdiagnosis of cancer, saying that they, they thought it was cancer when it was really just nematode worms. But back then they didn't have the technology of today, so I don't understand what their excuse is. Um, like this was 88 years ago that they had the same problem as now and there's no way it wasn't on purpose how do you forget that somebody won the Nobel Prize for the same thing a hundred years ago almost like ridiculous man ridiculous this is like you can't you can't hide it anymore you guys are fucking evil evil bastards evil <laughs>